Feel your passion. Join the Stick Shift family of YouTube channels. Subscribe now. Moment of truth. Welcome to Stick Shift Hot Wheels. Today I'm doing a review on the Hot Wheels ID 2020 Series 2 vehicles of the 69 Cobo Camaro. Each of these vehicles will have its own review, so please check out my related videos. The year was 1969. Though General Motors had a corporate policy against installing engines over 400 cubic inches in anything but full-size cars and Corvettes, Chevrolet production promotions manager Vince Higgins pulled strings at the corporate level to get around this by using the Central Office Processing Order or COPO program. Normally reserved for fleet builds, Higgins was able to use COPO 9561 to get Camaros built on the assembly line powered by the L72 code 427. 425 horsepower special high performance big block engine. This car shows just 17,000 miles on the odometer and is painted rally green with steel wheels and the mandatory ZL2 cow induction hood. This former race car has the four speed transmission and its original heavy duty 12 bolt rear end. The 11 to 1 compression ratio 427 engine made 477 horsepower on the dyno. Like most Copo packages, the interior was basic black with a Hirsch shift knob atop the Muncie transmission. Here we go. yellow plate on the back of the car. It says Hot Wheels on it. Oh, that's just the icing on the cake. Yeah, baby. Oh, this thing is freaking amazing. If you like Hot Wheels ID cars, this is literally a must have. You gotta get your hands on this. It's part of the Factory Fresh series. It's car number two out of four from the Series 2 2020 line. The 68-69 Camaro was the very first Hot Wheels car ever produced. So this is very cool that they're doing the Copo edition where basically you could put a race car engine into your Camaro from the factory, which is just absolutely badass. Uh, you know, they didn't run on street gas very well. They were temperamental, but they have gods of horsepower. And this is very cool. I love the detail in that front grill. You can see all the slats perfectly. You can see the headlights there. Absolutely awesome. This Kelly Green Spectre Flame color is very cool. Um, it's a little bit lighter of a green than I originally thought. I thought it was going to be a little bit darker seeing photos of it in person. But oh my god, does it shine and it shines well. Um, there's a tampo on the bottom door sill. There's silver, which is very nice detail. So they actually tampoed the plastic base of this car for the side there. Coming around the rear, you see the Camaro's six tail lamps, which is very cool. And they even added an original black plate to the vehicle, which says Hot Wheels. The Hot Wheels logo stamped in between the tail lamps is kind of my only omission on this car. It's kind of weird. Coming around the side, you see the awesome hockey stripe with the 427 emblem on that front fender. It looks absolutely awesome. The details right in front of the rear wheels look nice. Those vents there. It's an absolutely stunning model and, you know, I literally just opened this car today and I cannot wait for them to do a recolor of this model for a Hot Wheels ID car. That's how absolutely awesome this is. It's got front and rear side marker lights. The interior is black as it should be. And it's gorgeous. 
absolutely stunning. This is one of the nicest Hot Wheels models I've seen in a long time. Well done Hot Wheels, well done. It's got super wide, exaggerated wheels in the rear. Check out that knee. This casting is different than the Copo Zamek Flames Camaro. This car has a raised up stance in the rear, which is a little bit different. I just wanted to give a shout out to jcardiecast.com from Texas. I purchased these new 2020 Hot Wheels ID vehicles from his online store. He has great prices and he has ultra quick shipping. I got these cars in literally three days. So definitely check out his site for all of your Hot Wheels needs. And he also has convention pieces if you're looking for that rare special something. Now it's time to give the 69 Copo Camaro an Alex score. The 69 Copo Camaro is a legendary vehicle and it needs no introduction. Under the vehicle styling category, the Copo earns high praise from stick shift Hot Wheels, earning 8s, 9s, 10s, and 11s. The ID's Spectraflame paint is like candy and it earns an easy 8 out of 10. This has to be in my top 5 of Hot Wheels ID cars to date and it easily earns an 11 under model line continuity. It looks absolutely fantastic with any of the cars in the line. The total for vehicle styling is 50 out of 50 points. Seeing as this Series 2 Hot Wheels ID car has the potential to be a rare car, it earns very high marks under collector values, earning 8s, 10s, 11s, 12s, and even a 13 under hotness factor for a total of 54 collector value points. Added up in the Alex Flame score is a new high score of 104 flames out of 100. Thank you for watching my review of the Hot Wheels 2020 ID Series 2 69 Copo Camaro. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel, Stick Shift Hot Wheels. Click the notification bell and smash that like button. Share Stick Shift Hot Wheels with your friends. You may also like the following videos. As always, happy peg hunting.